Before installing the engine itself, let's first check the requirements. Nemesis requires C++ redistributable in order to function properly. Chances are you already have it, but for the sake of making sure, let's click the link. Scroll down and click the appropriate file for download. Install normally as you would any other executable. Follow the steps accordingly until it's completed. Back to the Nemesis mod page, click Files, and download with Mod Manager. Install it as you would any other mod. Activate. Next, right-click on an empty panel in MO2 and select Create Empty Mod. Name it Nemesis Output. Activate. Right-click on an installed Nemesis engine, open an Explorer, a new window will pop up, double-click the Nemesis engine folder, and then proceed to copy the entire path in the address bar. Back to MO2, click Edit, Add from File, click once on an address bar in a new window, paste, push Enter, and double-click Nemesis Executable. Start in, select Folder. Choose Force Libraries if you wish for them to automatically load when the executable is being launched, and more importantly, select files to Nemesis output instead of Overwrite. Click Apply. OK. For showcase purposes, let's use a mod that requires Nemesis to function. We'll use TDM. Install and activate as you would any other mod. Launch Nemesis Engine through MO2, which is what you should always be doing in the future, Select the appropriate boxes as instructed on a mod page. Update Engine. Launch Nemesis to generate behavior files, and that's it. Happy modding.